do, 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 do. is James Krause rich? Well, he, if he's, he better hope he is. Let's be real. James Krause better fucking hope that he's made as much money as he possibly can. Because he ain't got nothing now. So, they literally took away everything from him. Crazy. Kansas City rich, definitely. I mean, he is from a, a trailer park. So, uh, you know, I'm sure he, he's seen enough money in his time. But, uh, yeah, crazy. Loses his job. All fighters under him can't be coached by him. So that's going to mess up everything in terms of, like, Brandon Moreno's training camp. Fucking bonkers, I say. Absolutely bonkers. Yahoo! Thoughts on the James Krause situation? Fucking ridiculous, dude. Um, I don't know if he's innocent or not, though. That's the thing. But it just it seems very unlikely that he's innocent. Um, it seems very unlikely that he's innocent because why would the odds change in such a way unless he did give out some kind of information? But I feel like it's unfair to ban him from even being able to coach. Like, fair play banning him from being able to bet on the sport as a coach with inside information. But banning him from coaching fighters, that's like taking away his job. That's going beyond punishment. You know? That is literally going beyond punishment. Like, you can't take away someone's living. Or ban him for a year, Max. I mean, they're saying until they finish their investigation, but... You know, we'll see what happens. Maybe he's been tipping off people for a long time. But still, like, you know for a fact some NFL coaches are doing that shit. It's just he got caught doing it, I guess. Thank you for the $2. What's the situation? I just explained it top to bottom. Uh, James Krause had a fight with Derek Minna and uh, Shalian Nuriambeke. Um, It was a UFC fight night card. And uh, Derek Minna went out there in the first round, threw a kick, and uh, his whole leg ruptured. And he, like, went down to an injury and got TKO'd in the first round. The interesting bit is Derek Minna was James Krause's fighter. And uh, just before the fight started, backstage, um, the odds went from, like, minus 200 Shailan Nerdy Mbeke to, like, minus 400. So that means that a whole fuck ton of people put money on Shailan Nerdy Mbeke out of nowhere, all at once, all of a sudden. So people are assuming that James Krause told him to take a dive or just told everyone that he had a really bad injury. So maybe put some money on the other, uh, on the opponent or something. Thank you for the $5. I appreciate you fighters who train with him can no longer participate in UFC events. I reckon they're going to do it so that if they're continuing to train with him, it's not like if they've ever trained with him, they can't compete in UFC events. But I think the UFC is going above and beyond here. They're being real Nazis about this. I really do. Like, fair play, don't let him bet and keep a monitor on him while the investigation goes on, but you can't ban him from coaching fighters. That's fucked up. Thank you for the $5, dude. Thank you for the $2, 10th Planet Strike, and he should be in prison. They don't take this lightly. Okay. You know who should be in prison? People who own betting companies because they scam people anyway. Are we going to act like the UFC don't fucking scam people with certain dodgy moves that they do? With the betting. But now James Krause does it. It's a problem. UFC's been doing it. They've been rigging decisions a certain way. Oh, wow. Everyone has this guy in their fucking parlay. <laughs> Rob him. Rob him of the decision. Immediate. So, you know. Krause would get his friends to bet for him. True. True. Very true. But I hear Krause has made a shit ton of money, so... He should be okay moving forward. If anything, he can just start up his channel again afterwards and this will just give him more notoriety as uh, a person who bets on fights because clearly he knows all the insider stuff. So I'm sure there's not going to be like a ban on him even giving advice to people. You know what I mean? Thank you for the free Australian dollars, John Jones's fiance. Hopefully JK can release a Sanko tape to make some money. True, yeah, we need an OnlyFans of Sanko featuring James Krause. What will Moreno do? I don't know. Probably still train there with all of the same coaches, but Kraus will just have to step down from his coaching role for a bit, I guess. You know? 
But it doesn't mean he can't authorize people to keep coaching the people that are there. Can they still train it as gym? I don't know. Um, I think they can train it as gym. He just can't be directly involved in the coaching, I guess. Um, can't train it as gym per the UFC. That's tough. What if he hands over the rights of the gym to someone else for a bit under contract? There's a way around it for sure. They can't just relocate every fucking fighter at his gym. The UFC is going way overboard with this shit. And you don't even know if he's in it. He's guilty yet. I mean, sure, they can really strongly assume that he is, but they haven't even done the investigation yet. So they're literally being like guilty until proven innocent. Actually, James Krause could sue. <gasps> James Krause could sue a lot of money on that. If it comes back that he's innocent and there's no and there's not enough uh, evidence to suggest that he's uh, guilty of it, I know he's guilty. But if they can't prove it, he can sue for a shit ton of money. He ain't innocent. It's not about if he's innocent or not. It's whether or not they can prove that he's guilty. He may well be guilty, but can they prove it? If they can't, they have no way of uh, lawyer fees too much. No. It, it, there's such solid ways that you can make money from this. It's not like the Mark Hunt thing. Um, just tuning in, but what evidence do they have against Kraus? Um, just the fact that the lines changed. I don't know what evidence they have. I'm not a fucking investigator. But I would imagine they've got messages on a phone, something along those lines. But how can they even obtain this information as a private company? At a pri as a private company, how can they uh, how can they force this information out of uh, James Krause? They ain't the CIA. 